Hey guys, we're out on the Green River trying to finish up this little challenge. I'm with Nina. We're at 338 pounds today and it's uh, close to the end of September. We got, we've added a new trot line. We have the original trot line and we got five limb lines and I threw out five jug lines about six hours ago this morning. So we're about to go check these. Kentucky. Some people call it Burria. Kentucky. All right. There's uh, 20 hooks on this, just like the other one, and I put all skipjack and some goldfish on it. We went by the jug lines. Didn't see anything obvious. One of them, I was kind of thinking, but uh, I don't think so. I think it was just bobbing up and down. I put water in them, so they got a little bit more weight. This line has just been put out. This is really their first run. Uh, first official run after we've uh, baited it up. So. You want to bait now? No, nah, we'll, we'll just run it and then I'll bait it. Now, hey. we're finally starting to have some cooler temperatures. Not cool, but cooler. Um, I mean, the river can't have dropped more than a degree or two, but it's actually made a huge difference already. Did you see that? He almost made it. He did make it. He did make it. <laughs> Perfectly came out of that hole. There's a little bucket here. I got a, just a single hole in it. Just to put an aerator on it. Oh, right there, right there. Oh! What is it? It's the biggest gar I've ever seen. Is it alive? I don't really know. I don't. I bet not. Holy crap, look Holy at that guy. Holy macaroni. That's See? Big <laughs> dang gar. Holy crap. I think he's dead. Let me at least get him in the boat. I honestly, yeah. I'd like to know how big he is. Let's get a good shot of him. Yeah, he looks like a freaking alligator. I'm just gonna... He might come off though. They rip off a little easier than, uh, I'm pretty sure he's dead. Recently dead. Yeah, you, I got the, I got brought both nets for once. I just don't know where to grab him. My hand won't fit around him. Let's see if he Usually can just... I can just Drag him over the side. Yeah. I'll counter that. Oh! <laughs> There's one less guard to steal the bait. And that is a, he's been stealing bait for years apparently. I would have liked to get him in, but you couldn't even see the hook, so I think he was just like. Yeah. We either caught a grouper or we hit a snag. Well, we're not going to mess with trying to get it out on camera if it's hung up again. This is actually kind of common. We uh, used to always get hung up and have to run lines from one side or the other around a snag instead of cutting a line. Uh, currently, that's what we're doing. But I'll mess around with the line trying to get it out. But as I was saying earlier, this line was actually put in between the two lines that we had in the, the spring. Sorry. Oh. Feel something. I got the small net and the big net back here, so you know. I do not know yet which one we need. Small net. There's a small net right here. Scalpel. Scalpel. <laughs> yeah, actually, uh, I think, yeah, last video, we lost one by not using the net. We 
threw we, it up. We got one by not using the net. All right, little blue cat. Little video feller. Oh. Right off the bat. I like when it's not right there, it means it's bigger. Yeah. It's uh sometimes I've been fooled. Smaller fish and then uh bigger fish feel small, small this, fish. This fish is bigger than that fish. And again guys we're we got bluegill. Oh I'm still not up on it yet. We got bluegill, we're going to bait this line. We baited the other side before we dropped it. He fooled me. There might be a second one further down. There's some bubbles going on right over there. Yeah. Yeah, it wasn't him. There's another fish. And it's right behind me there. I'm catching a lot of them, them size blue cats. All right, stand up. Is that right there in your face? He's not big, but they were side by side. I think that's what I was feeling. Did he just get off? I think so. Wow, <laughs> okay. Um, there was another fish about exactly the size of those two on this hook right here just a moment ago. So. Oh, I just got chills. What is it? Let me back up and breathe for a second. What color was it? Pale. Oh, that's a flat. Oh, I guess I better show it. All right, he's a, he's a, he's, he's a big one. Oh no, don't pull too hard. Don't pull too hard. Guys, <laughs> it's my favorite thing. Yeah, that's a good sign too. That's another reason I'm fishing with uh, bluegill. I'm, I'm hoping they'll start moving. Looks like at least one of them is. All right, so the big net. Or you want? You could probably use the little net, but the big net would make it so much easier. Give me the big net. There you go. Definitely caught bigger, but I'm I'm happy with this guy. Careful. All right, and that. That's a good size, and we lost the blue, but we got a brown. <laughs> That's better, right? <laughs> we'll take it. Alright, five live lines, like I said, and we're just going to go by them. We'll bait them on the way back out. That's number one. Asian carp. Looks like we got one straight ahead, I think. Oh, lip lines. You didn't tell me they were any lip lines. I just said five lip lines. Oh, I can't hear. Oh. All I can hear is... Oh. Yeah, we put five limb lines the other day. Nice. Actually, not long after you... Not long after Friday the 13th. Maybe the next day. I was in the hospital. No. Where'd they find you? Under the car. Spot for you though. You roll under there to stay safe afterwards. I think he put put me there. <laughs> we got us a big old fish right here, boy. Oh, that's a yanker. You like it? I like it. I like seeing that right there. Look at that. Oh man. Oh. Hold on. Show it one more. Look at that tree branch. Hold on. It might be a big fish. <laughs> is <it? laughs> no. He is an absolute. He's a fighter. Oh! No. <laughs> That's what we get. It was this big. That's what we get for messing around. All right, on to the next one. We hadn't had a limb banger like with that in a while. It was a banger. And I don't believe we got anything on this one. That all skipjack. Hold on, hold on. Oh. There is something oh. on this one. I thought it was kind of angled up wherever, but yeah, there's something. Okay, let's try not Might to lose. Let's try not to lose this one. 
Yeah, I can put skipjack on this. Oh, he's got it. Oh, he swam it under something. Oh, he's not bad. Give me the net. Quickly, quickly. <laughs> oh, yeah, here's a good one. An ugly, one of them ugly blues. Ooh. All right. Weird looking. Yeah. All right, we're going to get this off, and then we're going to go over to the trot line. This is... Is that okay? Uh, yeah, this is a Wally line. Catfish Doug, if you're watching out there, I just want you to know that I really like your trot line, and I would actually pay for others just like it. I took both of those rolls that you sent, and I put them as one line, and it's pretty much perfect for what we're looking for. I make my own leaders, though, but... Just so you know, uh, contact me at hooklinechill at gmail.com if you have uh, uh, the ability to get any more of these lines. <laughs> this is a really nice trot line. You weren't joking. Yes. Oh, I feel a bump already. It's got a... It's a little thicker. I mean, nothing against the other trot lines. Trust me, they're, they're better than the ones I would make, but at the same time... This trot line is, like, pumped up. It's getting... I'm not feeling anymore. It's getting closer to fall. Actually, it is fall. Today's fall, isn't it? The 21st, yeah. Is it 21st or 23rd? But either way, it's pretty much fall. And uh, it's been a long, a lot of runs this year. I'm going to go ahead and say it's been uh, 100 days on the river this year. Coming up on one. Up on a fish. Big, big old gar. Oh! Mm. Whoa! That was a monstrous blue cat. That is a 30 plus blue. <laughs> Let me reacquaint myself. We're gonna need the big net. Look at that. Michael, I think he's bigger than that. What was it, 28 pound? We did catch a 30. Yeah, but I think he's bigger. That's a, that's a lot of fish. We're about to find out. Let's get him, we gotta get him in the boat. I'm a little bit scared. Alright, I'm gonna record and like I said, I, I can set the camera down and do what I can do. Don't you help me. I'm not gonna help you. Y'all heard her say it. Let me get that. Just oh. get get a couple more pictures and footage of him just in case. Let me get this bucket out of the way. Oh, he's drifting out quickly. Alright guys, I'm gonna try to get, look at them. That's a big one. That's a shark. Real, shark. real, real, real big one. That is almost a noodler. <laughs> I wouldn't want to put my hand in its mouth. He's really not going down, down. He's tired. The water's probably still so warm. Yeah, like I said, we got uh, three blue cats. Flathead, and hopefully we get this monstrous blue in the boat. Oh my god. Oh, careful. I know it, I know it. You're probably gonna... I see. There you go. Oh my buddy. <laughs> Swimming to it. Hold on, hold on. Okay. It's probably going to have to... Just let him go down. Hold on. Um. <laughs> hold on. I'm gonna have to help. Nope. Oh. There you go. Get a good angle on him. And there you go. Right there. You got it. Nina Wren. Whoa! <laughs> He's in the... Yeah. <laughs> He's in the net. And now once she gets him oh. over the edge. Hey, JD. <laughs> uh, that, my friend, is a monstrous blue cat. And we're gonna get it off the hook and show it better here in a second. <laughs> Alright guys, we're gonna weigh this at the very end, but uh, it's a mix up flathead pretty small. That's definitely a giveaway. So we're gonna do a random giveaway. Nina, do you got any names or anything? $25 gift certificate to Cabela's. Two minute to think of, man. I'm gonna let you handle that. Alright, I'll be looking while she runs the rest of this line. Yeah, we might have another big one. 
All right, here's the winner. $25 gift certificate to Cabela's. It is Vasco Chicago. Just comment on this video, I'll find you. Well, what's the comment? Well, it's not a comment, it's a commenter. Oh. I mean, if you email me, you comment me, you talk to me in public, I'll try to remember your name and uh, random. I mean, the, the particular comment was, Michael, I always comment about the ladies. But hey, thanks for taking the time to make such calm yet exciting entertainment. Hey, I wish you and the ladies a great day. Thank you. And that was a while back, but if you're still watching out there, Vasco, Chicago. Oh, we got another small one. Just uh, comment on this video and I'll find you. And you, you've won a $25 gift certificate to Cabela's. And we're about to do a, I think we got one more fish here. And we're about to do a uh, weighing. Oh, that is a, that's, that's as big as the one you lost while ago. Trout lining. The only time 12 inches is a disappointment. Oh, Nina and her one liners. Boosh! That's probably the most dangerous fish in the boat. Yeah, he really is. All right, guys, this bag is taking a beating. I poured a bunch of stable fuel all over it. And uh, some fins have went through it. And uh, actually the white rabbit was in with it and uh, it's now green. <laughs> so I'm waiting on my next one to come out. We're gonna weigh all these small ones first. Like I said, we're at 338 pounds right now. And we'll see, we'll see what these small ones weigh. And then we'll, uh, we'll weigh this big one. We'll see. All right, we're off the ground. And off balance. All right, like I said, it takes a bit. Right now it's saying 16 and I'm about 23, 26. I was going to say, it's, it's, it's close to 30. 26, 26. We're going to go with 26. That's 26 and then we're going to add this big old fish, which I'm thinking is 30 plus. Nina seems to always get the big fish. Good luck, Nina. I'm gonna bet. I'm gonna say 30. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Two. I'm gonna say right out 30 because this bag feels of similar weight to the one that was full of fish at only 26. So Hold on. I'm not gonna estimate. Gonna I'm not. I'm not gonna estimate over 30 pounds. But I think he's 30. Every bit of 30. All right, so right, what was it? 26, the first one, and it's 34. All right, currently we're at 32. I forget, did I say 32? I, I just said 32, 34. As soon as I picked it up, I think I said 32. I can't remember. I think you did. We're going with 32 pounds. That's probably about right. 32 pounds plus 26 is what? 56 pound day. Wait, you said 32? 58 pound day. 58 plus 38 is 88 plus 8, 96. 396. We'll finish next week. Well. If we don't find it, we'll have to put a reward out for it. I thought I saw it, but it was a plastic bag. There's a light spot by the bank. Wait. That's a jug. That's a jug. <laughs> All right, never mind. It, oh, wait, what's that over there? No, oh, wait. It's trash. Okay, no, wait, no, wait, no, wait. No. Okay, it's, it's right on the bank. It's actually a good sign. It's not going anywhere though. Yeah. Well. Oh. Number five. And uh, oh, we've I been we've been skunked several times on the jokes. Comment below if you have any suggestions. Ah, Michael. There's a fish on it. Is there? I thought it was going to come up real easy and it pulled back. It's got a goldfish on it. Either that or it's stuck 
back Hold on. Oh, wait. Oh, I watch, put the camera out. I didn't want to pull him off. Oh, shit. I'm hitting the bank. <laughs> I'm trying my best. We haven't had anything on a jug that would pull it. Look, it's pulling the jug. Oh, did you see the fish though? Was no, it kept... I thought it was just stuck in the mud. Look at it, look at it. Oh, yes. <laughs> Pull it under. That's awesome. I've honestly never seen this before. Well, we've caught a few, but they've all just been sitting still. That's the first one that actually was swimming <laughs> around. So it's probably a gar or something. Yeah. Last time, well, the biggest fish we caught on a jug was a gar. It's actually. Da 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 da. I don't know how well this camera's working out, but oh. oh, it's a it is a good sized catfish. Here. Oh yeah. Uh. Oh man, that's so freaking. That's, that's, that's a good one. Awesome. Oh my god, now we gotta do another weighing. <laughs>